please be at Joe's show tonight. You pack grapes for Joe's lunch. Joe doesn't like grapes. No, Jay. No grapes. And Joe doesn't like when you get home late. He doesn't like that you don't speak to him. He doesn't like that you are always on your laptop, working. And I don't like it when his mum whines in my ear all the time. <coughs> you used to be fun, you know that? Fun? <laughs> Is that what you were doing? Having fun? When you forgot your son's show? I'll make it up. Make it up? That's what you say when you forget something once. Not when you forget everything important in his life. And what? You think you're the perfect parent. Like, you have everything right. You, you're drinking half the time. You're more bothered about your painting than you're about Joe. If it were up to you, he'd never go to school. You don't give a crap about what he does. He'll be painting, walking around without his shoes. Incense everywhere! Well, at least he'd be happy. Yeah, right. And he'd have a mother who'd go to his concerts. Steph, st stop! up for nothing. For this mess. Do you know how frustrating it is to open up your heart to someone and they just stand there staring at you like, like you're not even there. And you're standing there thinking, say something. Say anything. I don't know what to say. Well, say that then. Anything is better than nothing. So I don't feel so so... When you need me, I am there. And when I need you, where are you? You're speaking to some other woman. Steph. You and I broke up. We have a kid. We are not together. That's not how it works. Well, how does it work then, Paul? Hmm? You come round here to do your washing, you eat my food, use my electric, you pick and choose when you want to be a good father. Steph. I need to tell you something. What?
Dear Paul, for some distance I've realised that I should have let you go a long time ago. We both deserve something better. In all honesty, I am sure Joe will love having a new baby brother or sister. Give me some time, but we'll be in contact soon. Where about they? They are lovely. Thank you. You're welcome. I was thinking about the letter the other day. I just wanted to say I'm sorry. It was both our faults and we held on to it longer than we should have. And I have not always been easy to be around, I know. Yeah, you haven't. <laughs> but I guess time heals. I got you something. She doesn't have to walk around barefoot. Yeah. Incense everywhere. Thank you. Is that for me? No. That's for me. <laughs> 